oh, I found the perfect one for me. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> <laughs> I think Milk and I have the same glasses. See, I thought my my photo would be funnier because I can't actually straighten that one finger. <laughs> so it's just like a really awful s signal. <laughs> I'm trying to be ironic. Start her up. Start him up. Start her up. I'm going to give the best Welcome damn speech point. you've ever heard. NTNX. the best of the best, and that's you. Let's get things going. Hopefully we'll get an audience First, you're going to craft some unique speech titles for each other. Create three titles. On your devices, finish the Those three speech there. titles two. you've been given. Fill in the blanks with something unexpected. Have fun with it. Oh, I didn't get to complete that thing yet. I couldn't think Are of really? anything. So the last one yeah. almost... Now, pick one of the titles... <laughs> the second one I hit submit answer by accident. This will be the title of your presentation. <laughs> All right, I like this one. I like that one. That's pretty good. Keep us no matter what. <laughs> this one's gonna be kind of tricky. Well uh, time to read them all. So yeah, that was a check it out. You will be the first speaker, and you will be their assistant. What exactly are you going hmm? to be doing? Wait, what? I don't know how this works. All right, hold on, hold on. You will be presented with a series of slides chosen by the assistant. When you see a text <laughs> slide, read that text out loud. <laughs> this is going to be good. And move on quickly. When you see a picture slide, just say words until something makes sense. What? You can even draw and type on the slide. Slides will be picked so confused. In real time. So I'm picking slides for you to help your speech. Am I supposed to say the name of my speech? Yes, you can say the title, and then um, I'm gonna like go through the. Uh... I'm basically picking your slides for your PowerPoint. Okay. What the fuck is this? <laughs> it was like a big college. Great yeah. at public speaking? <laughs> I suck at public speaking. Yeah, this isn't great. Oh no. This should be interesting. Am I supposed to remember which one I picked? Because I don't remember. Yeah, I don't remember what I picked either. They'll probably tell you. Okay. Don't forget. Pick first picture. Advancing the slides. So when you're ready. Um. Okay. Oh, Hi. <laughs> um, I'm here to talk to you today about drinking. Um, you know, what's better than going to bed when you're fucking smashed on two for one margaritas? Um, it's uh. it's great. You know, it's um. Uh. You wake up the next morning, you don't know what the fuck happened. Uh, you can't remember if you had a good night's sleep or not. Um, <laughs> it's happening because it, it's... Applebee's is having a special. Um, and also that. Shit. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, you know what? You can bring any kind of lady. You can bring... Your friend that gets drunk really easily, you can bring your friend that um, needs a lot to drink. Uh, oh god. It, just go fucking have some margaritas and get a good night's sleep. I don't know what else to say. And also do that. <laughs> Whatever um, that is, what's that? Talk to him about that. Your dreams are going to be fucking weird. You're, you're going to be dreaming up shit that does not exist. <laughs> okay? It is a great idea to drink so many margaritas before you go to bed. Thank you. <laughs> so half of your score comes from engagements. You know how many times people Oh wait, was well, I supposed to pick one of the little the other hand thing thingies? I don't know what I was supposed to do. You know how a graph works. Put it together and that's your score. Not bad. And of course, some points that was a nightmare. <laughs> this is picking the most random pictures. It's pretty funny though. I enjoyed that. Pull out your quotes and notes. What was the best picture to represent your talk? Let's see. I think this one right here. I think this about your hopes and dreams that you're talking about, that the dinosaur Venn diagram. Did I say that? I blacked out. Yeah, you were talking something about your hopes and your dreams with drinking, and they're going to be weird. 
but it's going to be mm. worth it. Yeah, I think that picture summed it up very well. That was my that was my vote. But the motor oil and the uh, be weird. the exorcism the motor might be oil. Good. No, was that an option? I they typed it wrong. All right, Z, you're up. Narwhal, you're oh, his uh, you're his assistant. You get to scroll through the like PowerPoint slides and pick a text to match the PowerPoint slides. <laughs> okay, all right. And Z, your job is just to keep talking and scrolling through as you need to. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be good, Z. <laughs> Yo, uh, so today I'm going to be talking about uh, how chicken, uh, by paying it... your, ch- oh, wait, wait, I have to read this thing. Yeah, that's your but time. paying your taxes and recording your income is a total waste of time. Why would you want to do that? Like, just, why would you want to do that? Like, wouldn't you rather be playing video games or something or hanging out with chicken or your friends? Like, wouldn't you want to do, why wouldn't you want to do that? It makes sense. It doesn't make sense. <laughs> Make sense to me. <laughs> what about your graphic? Explain the picture on the screen. Oh, well, um, see, these are two people that are waiting to be in love. Like, God already had a plan out for them and everything. <laughs> Damn, it's deep. So they were supposed to meet that day. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm going to share a controversial option with you. <laughs> 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 oh my god so you see if you look on the screen here this is our plans for 2022 uh <laughs> we, we're gonna have to go take down this big lizard and there's like a bunch of gold inside or whatever i don't know uh but yeah that's what we call a narwhal that is the, nar- the narwhals of 2022 <laughs> There was one thing that changed everything for me. You guys are going to hear about this. Are, are you ready? I don't think you're ready for this. <laughs> <laughs> it was me blindly in my dream walking down stairs until I fell to my death. Just all the way down. <laughs> blindfolded. Like, I didn't even know when I was going to hit the ground. Like, you know, I just said, this is my time. Death and taxes, am I right? Yeah, I know. This is what taxes made me do. That's so good. Taxes just forced me to do this. Uh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Beautiful. I love that. Uh, I love that. Com- like the iguana with the army man. <laughs> That's a great picture. I'm share. I'm share. Uh, that was amazing. You can see that your speech really peaked during the iguana <laughs> presentation. <laughs> <laughs> That was killing oh. it. That was killing it. <laughs> it's supposed to be like suicide, but that works too. God. <laughs> the dream. Love it. Start off okay. You had the people checking their watches. Oh, I forgot. My phone like turned off because I wasn't touching it. <laughs> oh, I think the. Yeah, the iguana definitely represented it best. Yep. That was the power walls of 2022. <laughs> I'm gonna give you the biggest smile in the world for my sister. Alright, narwhal speech time. Oh. Uh-oh. That means it's gonna be chicken speech time. Hello. Be the- my, my name is narwhal, and my talk is, um, well, uh, it is. Oh, I can move it. Fucking shit! I'm out of time. Well, save us. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> so, oh, at this time? point, I was, I was down astronomically in the banana hedge fund and you know i was i was uh you know where did this start well let me tell you well i'll show you actually <laughs> this is when my bitch of a wife karen cheated on me and i i had dumped all my savings on, i'm telling you the whole nine yards right uh you know that's my house you bitch and so Oh, yeah, I was devastated. So I threw my heart away and started dumping my money into the, the banana hedge fund. Here's something that makes me feel good about this situation, though. It's not all bads. Listen. This. <laughs> nothing better. There's just no better feeling in the world than cozying it up with your big boy. You know, a nice ass in your face. Sniffing. It's great. It really brought me out of the deepest depression of my life. Uh, I don't know how I got here, but, 
Oh yeah, the banana hedge fund. Right. You gotta so we're you down bad. I need your help. Please save me. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> that was truly beautiful. That started off strong and stayed strong. It was very good. I don't know if we got enough engagement though. Oh, oh wow. No. The banana hedge fund. Banana hedge fund tanked again. Alright, chicken. I'm gonna be the best assistant in the world. Good job, good job Narwhal. I, I, you really moved a lot of kids with that speech. <laughs> now they're reconsidering their marriage. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, what do we have here? I'm gonna be next. Great. Let's see how this goes. I'm the next yeah. Gary V or whatever his name is on TikTok. I'm gonna be Tony Robbins here. I'm gonna talk you into something that make you feel good about yourself. <laughs> do it, Tony Robbins. Let's do it. Let's do it. Okay, Z, you gotta get me some good pictures here. Let's begin I'll my try. speech. What is my speech? What's my thing? Hi, my name is Chicken. All right, C H I C K E N. <laughs> and here's my talk for you. Okay, my talk is your mom is not a joke. So stop laughing. All right, not a joke. Look at that. This guy's a clown. You laugh at him. Don't laugh at your mom. She works hard. All right. Look at this. Actual clown. Lol. That's your mom? Not my mom. Not mom. <laughs> <laughs> Highlight that. Thanks. Damn, they're not giving, now, they're not giving me you picture. won't be chuckling when I show you this. There's nothing <laughs> funny about that. See that? <laughs> There's nothing funny about that. Look at this. Not funny. <laughs> right? Nobody's chuckling about that. This what is this, a radiohead video? Get out of here. Fucking okay computer here. Now I'm gonna share something with you that is something that's actually quite humorous. I find this really funny. Look at that. We shouldn't have eyelashes. What is that? This is funny. But mom isn't. Leave her alone. She works hard. All right. Look at that. Lemon's got great eyelashes, by the way. Goes to Sephora. Would recommend. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. The pictures they give you, like, really so suck. Those are, like, the best. <laughs> that was really good. Well, don't laugh at mom. That's the moral of the story. Oh, man. Dang, you're off the charts. <laughs> well, everyone loves their mom, you know? I'll, I'll take 139. I think you did a good job, Z. I'm going to give you a happy face, smiley face report for that. I'll take it. Was it a truly groundbreaking speech? I know. I moved a lot of little kids. <laughs> Touched a lot. That was for all, the, that's all for all the moms out there, you know? <laughs> All right, name the award I will give out. I name the award I'm going to give out. Let's take a moment to remember. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> I learned so much. <laughs> <laughs> it is stride with the Liz. <laughs> Life changing. <laughs> My mother emotionally scarred me. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> it's like YouTube comments. Uh, award ceremony. It. Each one of you has one last big award to bestow, and that includes the audience. Oh. The Benito Award. Uh, okay. Isn't it nice when your opinion matters? <laughs> All right. Finally, the big honors. <laughs> oh wow! <laughs> Who's gonna present that one? <laughs> oh, I got <laughs> the big boy award. See, chicken, you That's got That's a big my boy award. thing. The Benito Award. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, two oh, awards for Z. The Dingus Award, <laughs> straight from Dr. Steve Brule. 
<laughs> His big dangus. His dangus. Oh, man. Z Congrats. was the winner. Z is the winner. He got the Benito Award and the Big Boy Award. Or no, really came through Z. Uh, I don't know. Hey, what was it? To the assistant. Yeah. Assistant. Best assistant. That was brilliant. All right, we got to do this one more time. This was pretty great. Yeah, that, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I like that. This was great. I think we're getting the hang of it. Cool. Two. Oh. I had to think. I had to think now, on it. Pick one of the titles that has been sent to your device. <laughs> this will be the title for the oh new presentation. <laughs> oh, my These gosh. are such great titles. You guys really did a great job. Oh, my God. There's like two of these that are good. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my god, these are so amazing. Yeah, right, I gotta read I have to I have to read these for you. As my therapist said, I really have to stop threatening Sue for black now and why in the Jar Jar Binks of Daycare. <laughs> these are such great great titles. I didn't know which one to pick. Alright, let's do this. Alright, let's go. Hi. My name is uh Milk Rot. And as you all know, my parents are getting a divorce. So Let's I'm going to tell you about their conversation they had with me. Um, and how they broke it to me about why this was happening. Um, this is not funny. Don't laugh. Um, we're very broke. <laughs> so we can't actually afford to go through with it. Um, so right now we're all just living in the same house. And it's a very <laughs> miserable atmosphere. But there's still love. Um... um so my mother told me that I need to be brave. Um. Oh, shit. It, it didn't let me pick one. <laughs> uh, I'm at better. a loss here. It's somehow better. <laughs> I've lost her. You know what? Sometimes there's just, you just have too much to handle. The, the situation just gets too much, and you can't... Uh, if the ball is too big for your mouth, it's not your ball. Is what they told me. Um, what does that mean? Holy shit. And you know what? After they told me about what was going to happen, they told me something great. Uh, oh god. Uh, at a loss for words. I'm at a loss for words. You know what? Uh, <laughs> she looks like something that would come out of some horror game. What's going on? <laughs> you know what? In closing. In closing be brave, buddy. <laughs> you got um, this. This sucks. dog. <laughs> this sucks. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> that was hilarious. <laughs> Dude, the slides work so perfectly for that, too. <laughs> Sorry, that last one, I really had to think very hard about it. It was the best slide I've had all the time. <laughs> Thank you, Z. Uh... I'm glad someone used that prompt. <laughs> it was very relatable. <laughs> the mining down the drain one was the best. Yeah, it was pretty great. That was good. Narwhal, the dingus. Right, you Here's your credentials right. from the Alaska, the dingus award winner. <laughs> uh, the dingus uh, award winner. Let's hello, get it. my name is Narwhal. And my talk today is drop everything and put your faith in credit karma. I didn't Listen. pick one. I'm no stranger to the stock market, all right? I know how much it can fuck up your life. Those banana hedge funds will strip you naked and suck you dry, if you know what I mean. Drop everything and put your faith in Craig Karma. When I said this next thing at my local library, they actually banned me for it. I shit you not. I'm ready. You guys ready? You guys ready to hear this? <laughs> Need I say more? Moving on. <laughs> If you asked me last year, I never would have believed I'd say this, but, well, but, <laughs> you know, <laughs> you know, I, trust me, never would have said it last year, but this is the year I become a fit black man. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Let's look at the graph. I ain't gonna do it. <laughs> nice. I the failed you. I failed you as a bad nuts. I didn't know what to do with the nuts. There was just such random pictures. I had no idea what yeah, to do with it. 
<laughs> These <Amazing>. nuts. <laughs> oh, I should have said that. Got him. <laughs> Thought about it after. These nuts. The uh, Dingus Award winner, Narwhal. I love the credentials on the screen for this. <laughs> With the dog and the headscarf. Oh, look at Z's credentials over here. The Benito, the Benito Award, Award and the Fucky Award. And the Fucky Award. <laughs> All right, you ready? Yeah. Hello, my name is Z. <laughs> and, you know, the talk today is... How finally getting a dad could fix everything in my life. <laughs> <laughs> so, well, you know, I, my parents... So we're like a little poor. My dad left me as a child. So I need cash. But then my mom got this guy who had a bunch of cash and was heck of rich. So I stole his credit card. Uh, went to the bank, cashed it out, yada, 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 whatever. How is this even possible? Well, see, you need to learn. You're, you're gonna have opportunities you gotta take. <laughs> so, I put a dinosaur head inside of this huge thing that we call, I don't even know what it's called, like, who, who would know what this is called anymore? But yeah, this is what rich parents get you. What can be done about this? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. <laughs> <laughs> So, what? but then one day these cockroaches just kind of invaded my house and I lost all my money. Yep, that's right, I'm poor. So, to sum things up, having rich parents doesn't do anything for you, and I would rather just not have any parents. Jesus. Thank you. I hope this, <laughs> this really moved everybody. I really just didn't know what to say, to be honest. That, that was bad. <laughs> the slides kind of saved it. But... The cockroaches. The cockroaches <laughs> are pretty great. That one killed me as soon as I saw it. Oh my god! The broke cockroaches the are amazing. Come here. Let's... Cockroaches mm. broke the chart. <laughs> Carried me again, assistant. Well job done. Alright. It's chicken and milk's turn. All right, let's get this show on the road. Oh no! A big boy award. That's right. I'm gonna right. put on my big boy pants and give a speech. <laughs> All right, what do we got here? <laughs> Hello, my name is Chicken. My talk is, as my therapist said, I really have to stop threatening Stewart for blackmail. All right. Well, in a way, I am just an ape, right? Aren't we all? And uh, we go there, and we, we work our 9 to 5, and we gotta have therapy sometimes, right? And here I am, I'm just a working class chimp. And you know what? It sucks to be a working class chimp in this society, because guess what? Post-industrial life, not fun. So much pressure. I needed a therapist. And of course, this also issue stems from my childhood. That's definitely true. <laughs> it was a very rough childhood. Um... You know, I, I played the accordion and I was I was bullied mercilessly for it. It was my grandpa's accordion, you know, it was a family thing, but they're like, hey, wh what the hell are you doing, polka guy? Polka <laughs> is not cool. All right? It will get you beat up and you will need a therapist. <laughs> <laughs> this could be a sign of a completely different issue, such as biting the hand that feeds you. Right? Oh, man. You bite the hand that well, feeds no, you. No. Guess what? You, you're listening to Nine Inch Nails, and now you're Trent Reznor. He definitely needs a therapist. All right? <laughs> we got uh, and we got that. I mean, it's just a dog-eat-dog -dog world out here. And um, in a way, we're all the dogs constantly eating ourselves. And that's ultimately why that's I've got to stop, man. you know, blackmailing my therapist. That's deep, bro. Thank you. Oh, that was pretty deep. Snaps all around. <laughs> Chicken, I'd like to address something you said in your presentation. Yes. Leave a comment at the call. Was it Polka's not cool? Polka's kind of cool. Yeah. Polka's, Polka's very cool. Polka's, kinda cool. Polka's actually <laughs> She whooped out cool. the accordion. 
I actually had one too. Very cool. I actually had an accordion too somewhere. I lost it. But yes, I, I had an accordion once too. In fact, um, our, me and Narwhal's great grandpa used to play accordion on the radio. One last bit of prep before the award ceremony. Yeah. <laughs> it is to honor. Except I, I think like I'm still alive, but yeah. Oh. Do you feel old? These are the speeches we just saw. I'm so sorry. <laughs> you get the holes going on. The way dads are just cockroaches, though. I will be your father. <laughs> <laughs> and now, the moment of truth. Awards. of you has one last big award to give out and that where will the awards go i'm struggling <laughs> i gotta award this uh... and now at last the very serious and important prize where shall it go the juicy dump <laughs> truck <award>. nope. <laughs> <laughs> spanky <laughs> Posthumous. Spanky. Rest in peace, Spanky. The posthumous Spanky reward. Yeah, gotta, gotta give the it. Big dick pour one out for Spanky. <laughs> How's it going? Thank y'all. Uh, the Mr. Speechy Award. Alright, we're definitely gonna have to play this again in the future. <laughs> Hello, peeps. Thank you for watching today's video. If you have any content suggestions for what we should do in the future, please let us know in the comments section. And also, please be sure to like the video, subscribe to our channel, and help share our content so that we can grow our community of peeps and reach our new subscription goals. Thank you so much and hope you had a great time watching this and laughed along with us. Have a great day.